They don't really know how much they should eat to either lose weight, stay the same, or gain weight. And so I'm here with an answer for you to tell you exactly how many calories you should be eating. Now I want to say this before I get really into the exact number of calories is that it depends on a lot of things. I can't sit here and say every single person needs to eat this many calories to be healthy. That's just not the way it works. It depends on if you're a male or female, how much you weigh, your age, your height, your metabolic rate, um, just so many different factors. So I'm gonna help you kind of find out how much about, like approximately how much you should be eating, but I can't just say the exact amount right here for everyone because everybody's different. It depends on the person. Um, yep. I guess that's all I'm gonna say. Now I'm gonna get onto the actual like amount of calories you should be eating. You need to know your weight in pounds and your height in inches. And then you also probably need a calculator or to pause this video a couple times to do a little bit of math here and there. There's a lot of numbers that go with it, but you guys can come along with me and figure it out. I'm gonna be using my height and my weight to figure out um, how many calories I should eat. I'll guide you through it all, so come with me. I'm gonna show you on my whiteboard. And yeah, so get a calculator and let's go. So, okay, don't get scared out of all these numbers and words right here. I will tell you all what it means and it's a very easy to figure out. So this is for women. I will do an example for men as well because there are some different numbers you need to put in if you're a man. Um, so first to find your basal metabolic rate, you multiply your weight in pounds times 4.35. Then you add that to your height in inches times 4.7. Um, then you subtract 4.7 times how many years old you are and then add 655. I will do an example also of mine to show you how I do it. And so it's a little bit easier to look at and figure out. And then after you're done with all of that, you times it by your activity level. So 1.2 is sedentary, 1.375 if you do some type of kind of exercise, uh, 1.55 is moderate, meaning, and then 1.725 is very active. You work. So this is the women's version. I will show you the men's really quick, and then I will show you mine and how to calculate everything. Okay, here is the men's version. So show you my calculations and see if it will be easier. So first, the thing you do is multiply your weight times 4.35. I'm a girl, so I'm going to do that version. Obviously, you change the numbers up a little if you're a guy. And then you add that to your height in inches um, times 4.7. And then you subtract the how old you are, the number of years, and, and then times 4.7, and then you add 655. So I've already, this keeps getting blurry, I'm sorry guys, let me see if that helps. I already did my calculations to make things go by a little bit quicker. What that number means is the amount of calories you should eat to stay alive and to have your body functioning properly. That is the minimum you should be consuming on a daily basis. That's how much, how many calories your body burns just sitting there doing nothing. So now if you're actually doing something and you live some sort of life whatsoever, then we'll follow this next step to see how many you should eat with living as active as a lifestyle as you have. Okay, so now we're gonna take that number and multiply that by your activity level. So I'd consider myself a 1.725, which is very active, and multiplying those together 
brings us to 2,473. So that is how many calories I should be consuming. So I hope you could follow along and do it. It seems very confusing, but trust me, it's actually not. There's a lot of math and numbers, but it's actually pretty easy once you get into it. So yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, please. Um, watch all my other videos and yeah I hope this helped you with finding out how many calories you should eat per day and hope to live a healthy and fit life so I will see you next Sunday and bye for now